Okay, so let's get started. I was going to do both eyes at the same time, but my camera kept dying on me, so I'm going to try to get this done, just the one eye, <laughs> and um, get it done quickly. That way, hopefully, my camera doesn't die on me. I don't know what's going on, but anyway. Okay, guys, so um, I've already primed my lid, and so the first thing I'm going to do is go into my crease with um, this Sigma E40 blending brush, and I'm going to take max brown script shadow and I love this because it's kind of like it's just red brown and it just brings out blue eyes or li any light eye it's really great on any eye but it really makes light eyes pop so I'm just gonna put that right in the crease okay so now I'm just going to take this Sigma E25 blending brush and I am going to take Max Brick Red or Red Brick. I don't know. One of them two. Um, and I'm just going to put that also in the crease right where we just put that brown script. Okay. Now I'm going to be taking this Sigma E30 pencil brush and I'm going to dip that into um, the Amorese palette iridescent purple and I am just going to put that on my outer V as well as the inner corner of my eye and oh and I'm going to connect them okay and now I'm just going to um, take a clean blending brush and just kind of blend that together Alright, now I'm just going to be taking a no-name brush and I'm going to dip it into the color Vanilla, also from the Amrisi palette, right down here. Alright, so now I'm just going to be taking the small tapered blending brush, it's the E45 blending brush from Sigma, and I'm going to dip that into well, this is like all the Amrezy palette, but um, again, the Amrezy palette, and we're gonna dip into Deep Plum right here, and we're just going to smoke out the outer V and make it a little bit more, a little bit darker to create more depth. Again, we're just going to kind of blend that out so that it's seamless. Alright, and then I'm going to again take this no-name brush and I'm just going to dip it into um, this shimmery champagne color from MAC. This one is called Shroom, but any shimmery champagne white color will work. And I'm just going to put that right up here on my brow bone create some highlight and a lifted look to the eye. And we're going to put that right in the tear duct as well. Okay, now we're going to be taking that Sigma pencil brush again and we're going to take, um, what was it, Morocco and Caramel from the Amrezy palette. These two colors right here. And we are just going to put that on our lower lash line, just kind of mixing them together. Alright, and then I'm going to be dipping it back into the deep plum color that we use on the outer V. And I'm just going to put that right here on um, the outer half of the lower lash line. Okay. Now it's on to eyeliner. I'm not going to do a cat eye, which I normally do. It's kind of my thing. I love it. But I'm just going to line it um, right up top with this L'Oreal um, Infallible Slim Pen. And it has a felt tip. This thing is amazing. So I'm just going to do that real quick. Okay, now I'm going to be going in with my Bare Minerals Lash Domination Volumizing Mascara. 
I absolutely love this mascara. I'm definitely going to be picking it up in the full size once I run out of this little guy. But it's a really cool um, wand. And it's like it twirls. It like twists and twirls. And I feel like it really grabs on to your lashes. And when you twirl it, I don't know, I feel like it just boom, makes it so much, so much longer. Okay, um, last but not least are the lips. So I'm going to be taking this lip liner from Flirt Cosmetics, and it is in the color Fancy Smancy. Smancy? <laughs> Fancy Smancy. Is that how you say it? Schmancy. Fancy Schmancy. Okay, so that's what this color is. I absolutely love this color. You can just leave it like this. Um, I'm going to throw on this lipstick called Miss Temptress, also fla from Flirt Cosmetics. Um, yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay. And it's just kind of a light chocolate color, nude, nude chocolatey color. I'm just going to put that right on top. Alright, so this is the finished look. I hope you like it. Um, it is loosely inspired by Casey Hill's most recent fall video and, and her makeup tutorial was gorgeous and I was just like, ah, I need to bring out these carls and red colors. So I hope you like it. I really like it. Um, I think it's perfect for kind of like an everyday little something. Not too dramatic, but you can definitely um, make it more dramatic by adding maybe a little bit um, darker um, color to the outer V, like a black or even just like a really dark chocolate. Um, and you can pair it then with, like say, a bright bold lip. She actually used uh, Maybelline's Matte Lipstick in Divine Wine. This is actually, yeah, this is the color she used in her video. And it's, I mean, it's equally gorgeous. I just kind of wanted to keep it toned down, um, more of a daytime look. So. Anyway, I hope you like it. If you want to leave any suggestions on the comments below, that would be awesome. Um, I hope you like this, and yeah, I think that's it. I will see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye, guys.